suppose the secret weapon apart from a fish finder is Terry for skipper. He's, uh, he's got a lot of knowledge of the area. He's a um, cantankerous old bugger but he has his moments. One of the good things about the bay is, is there's always shelter. Even if they get a windy day, you're not going out through an entrance into the big wide ocean. You've always got islands and things you can uh, hide behind, even in the, in the worst sort of weather. So there's very few days you can't go fishing here. It's an excellent tour um, for all abilities, and um, if you haven't had much experience like me, it's really good because you can. Um, he teaches you how to do it and then encourages you to do it yourself and um, that's really good <laughs> for me. <laughs> if you're looking for those big photo opportunities of big fish, I, I always push um, middle of November to middle of December. If you're looking for fun, lots of very, very active fishing, uh, it's around the March period when the carwai come in. We're in five metres of water quite often. Um, and we're getting snapper probably up to five kilos and um, lots and lots and lots of car wine. and it's just it's good fun, pure fun. I've spoken to guys who have been on the shorter trips and they say it feels like um, they never got their line wet and it's a perception thing. The guys that come off, off this boat after a five and a half hour trip, majority of the time um, we've We've done okay by the end of the day. I, I firmly believe in what we do. We're not in mass production. We're out, out here to provide an experience.